Hey there, I'm uh, Jared Call, I'm the president of the GMC Tidewater Crabs, and this is my 1975 Eleganza 2, slightly modified. What we love about our uh, our motorhome here is um, this one. Just how this is. It came this way to us. Um, this was uh, this was uh, uh, um, the motorhome formerly belonged to our dear friends Karen and Seth Baldwin. Uh, of uh, they uh, they live in uh, Gloucester County, uh, Virginia. Uh, sadly, Seth passed away uh, a few years ago, um, and uh, we uh, we really miss him. But uh, we've uh, we've kept this coach going. Uh, for them and for us, um, but uh, one of the things we love about um, love about this coach is just the fact that, um, and you'll see here in a minute how open everything is and how wide everything is. You know, it's like this one is a um, got the, the full bed in the back, um, got storage down underneath here, storage lifts up down here. I've got all of my spare parts, anything that we need for journeys, anything like that. I could still access all of the. Uh, you know, even a cage for our dogs uh, if they want to be outside. Um, obviously, we've got the wardrobe, the wet bath, plenty of storage through here. Um, we've got our you know microwave hooked up. You know everything, everything here that you can really imagine. Um, uh, the uh, the three-way refrigerator as well, as well as a. Three-way refrigerator is one that um, so basically it runs on propane, on electric, or on battery. So I could choose basically you know which one depending on where I am. If I'm in a place that doesn't have a lot of hookups, I can I can basically use my propane gas to keep the refrigerator going for weeks at a time. Um, and this thing will you know be nice and cold. Um, but you know plenty of plenty of storage down in in each of these locations through here. Um, you know. We've got the uh, got the, the full sink. Um, one of the things that I do love a lot here is having having access to tools right by the door. Um, and you know, and this one, what I like what I like what they did here is they even built they built this up above about you know three inches. So I've got storage underneath here that goes all the way down, so I can keep tools and other things down there as well. Um, but as you see up here. One of the things that we love the most here is the fact that there's no cabinets right here. And that just makes it so that everything is just so wide open. Um, and those of you that, that have met me before know that I'm not a short person. Uh, I'm six foot five and I'm not really hitting the ceiling here. Um, so as I'm walking through, I don't hit my head on anything really. I mean, I might hit my head a little bit on this, but my wife might baby proof a little bit for me um, but uh, you know as you as you come through here you know the, the best part is just the windows um, you know it's kind of the best and the worst part because all the heat does come in the windows um, but the, the view is just absolutely incredible um, and I absolutely love it um, but Karen uh, when she owned this coach she was a um, she loved to cook um, and, and anyone that's ever been to any of our rallies um, knows we always have too much food. Um, between between Karen and Calmetta and uh, and Joanna and Ellie, all of them um, they they love making food, and uh, we always we have to start bringing extra Tupperware with us so that we can take some food home with us. Um, another thing with the coach is the um, is this you know the the, the day night shades. So it can either just go with one or go with the dark. They just come right up. Same on both sides. Um, you know, right part of the table, you know, does does fold out. And this is actually a GMC original table. Uh, we got this from, from friends. Um, this obviously folds into a bed. So, you know, we can fit typically three people, four, they really like each other. Um, Oh, I keep forgetting. Um, we uh, we travel with our five dogs uh, most everywhere through the country. So we've even converted um, down here. We've uh, we've uh, created integrated a, a dog kennel um, for for our dogs to uh, to be in. So they're they're comfortable as they travel. And if we go out, 
um, they have a place to be. They love it. Um, they, you know, when we start the when we start the GMC up, they're just they're running in here. It's actually a contest to see if you get up on the front seat first. So, um, yeah.